this is real. I'm not joking around. How many how many likes do I do I gotta get in this video? This is gonna be at the beginning of the video, right? Mm -hmm. There's gonna be a full 30 minute video, and this clip right here is gonna be at the beginning. How many likes for you to let me ride around on your forces for a week? Who have you become? Is crazy. Uh, it was pretty cold this morning. Alright, well, let me go. I'll probably back in it. Damn. Ah, no, no. I'm excited for this one. Oh, yes. Y'all are always uh, always giving me hell in the comments about not building. Why do y'all not build Fords? Why do y'all not build Rams? You know, it just, we have that niche of Silverados. But today I'm switching it up a little bit. Well, not me switching it up. We, you know, we get, we get lucky sometimes. Some things fall into our lap. We mounted a set of 26 by 16s last week. Uh, Ruthless Forge, I believe is what they are, or uh, Plan B, one of the two, I can't remember. And uh, on some 38 inch Furies, and they're going on a 2020 F350, that like uh, nice flaky red color. And the customer dropped off an eight to 10 inch Cognito Dirt Logic coilover lift kit for us to put on it. So 10 inch lift kit, 38s, 26 by 16s. You know, so, something for my Ford people. We're starting off on Monday for my Ford people. We got a three and a half inch ready lift going on a, a 2022. And then if you guys didn't know we're doing a uh, 2022 f350 white with a uh, 15 inch any level lift in january so that's going to be pretty uh, pretty awesome so, something for y'all to be excited about so the the fords are, are definitely you know pulling in hard right now and i'm super excited i'm going to keep you guys up to date on that one as, as the uh, the day goes on truck's going to get washed a little bit later here soon i'm trying to do better about doing intros hey hey uh, at exclusively at never satisfied bills.com that bread gang merch has dropped make sure you guys go check out the website show some love to the bread gang let's get the week started let's get this bread
RTP Customs coming through clutch on them. Hell yes. I told y'all last week that, you know, we had two McGoy's kits going on and I didn't get a chance to film it before it left, but thankfully, you know, we do a 500 mile retort on all the lift kits. So this truck was able to come back through so I could film it. 2021 Chevy Silverado, nine inch McGoy's lift kit, 20 inch XD Boneyards, and some 37 inch Mickey Thompson Baja Boss ATs. There's a lot going on with this truck, a lot going on. Not only does it have a nine inch McGoy's lift and some really nice wheels and tires, but something that's unique about this truck that we don't do on a lot of them is the crazy ass horn blasters kit that's on this truck. Now I'm not, I'm not sure what kit this is. I'm not too familiar with all the horn blaster stuff, but it's got six horns and it's loud as hell. And it's got a huge compressor, I'll tell you that. It is a monster of a kit, that's for sure. But I'll tell you what, it's it's nice sometimes to not see a big, you know, 26 inch wheel with, you know, in my opinion, this would be an easier daily driver. It's not something that you gotta worry about scratching wheels up all the time. You know, it's got the, it's got the amp steps on it. It's something like this, you can just hop in, you can ride out, you're not worried too much about it every day. In my opinion, it's a really beautiful truck. And I think it turned out really good. That train horn though, that's, that's what's killer. I'm gonna have to get him to hit the train one for it. Something about the front of this truck looks different to me. I don't know what it is. It, it looks a lot more, maybe it's all the chrome. You know, a lot of them have the, the chrome here and the chrome here. Not a lot have the chrome inserts in the grill. There's, I've seen some that have the chrome cross section here. I think really what it is is that, that chrome bug guard up front, that chrome kind of insert piece up top. I think that's what makes this look a lot different to me. I'm slowly growing to be a fan of the white, but uh, there's a lot of chrome on the front of this and it looks really good. Uh, I, I definitely think so. Exclusively at NeverSatisfiedBills.com, Bread Gang merch is live on the website. Exclusively at NeverSatisfiedBills.com. Show some love to the Bread Gang cops and merch right now. Link will be in the description. Ashley's on the way over here. Oh, it's early. Ashley's on the way over here. I couldn't let him come in, so let me let me give you a little backstory on Ashley. Ashley's the bread man. Ashley delivers bread for a living, like loaves of bread and, and little Debbies and stuff like that. He is the bread man. I couldn't, he sent us some pictures, he sent me an email of something that he was dropping off. Um, we're in a thread, me and me and Jake here, and uh, Ashley on an on a email. And he's supposed to be bringing us some sand. I couldn't let Ashley come in here and show us up. I couldn't let him come in here and show us up. So. I got something for, I got some bread for the bread man. I wish I had a hat to give him, but I don't. We'll give him a Southern Tire hat. But Sunbeam is the best, all right? I couldn't, I couldn't let him come in here and show us up. Ashley, I got something for you. All right, all right, all right. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. On a real note though, we got a lot of stuff to finish up. We got that, that eight inch F-250 lift outside that needs to get done. That one, uh, all red lift kit, 26 by 16s. Ashley's getting a seven inch lift with some 24 by 14s. We got a lot of shit going on this week. <clears throat> and you guys will see in the next video, you guys will see in the next video that uh, I'm putting some 26s on my truck tomorrow, so that'll be a big collab. A lot of stuff going on this week, a lot of stuff to get for it finished. High stress, high tension, but we love we love the challenge, don't we? Yeah, we do. <clears throat> I'm done. Riding around on a Sunday, and I, I just happened to look over at a uh, little this little outlook right here. We're just kind of cruising through Kennesaw, a little bit north of our house. Holy crap! That's so cool. Look at that. That's so cool. You see all the... Uh... Is that sand or what? I guess it's sand. Oh no, it's water. That's so freaking cool. Yeah, I guess we're too close to the, uh, yeah, because the air airport's right over there, so I, I can't fly the drone out here, but. Yeah, because the airport's right there, right next to me. That's so Look, cool. there's sand falling there. No, it's water. That's what no, I've been looking not. at. 100% that's water. That looks like sand. It's water. It looks like sand because the, the sun's bouncing off of it. That's so freaking cool. Ashley came and dropped off today a whole box 
I got a couple loaves of bread. Now this this box was filled to the top. It's com completely. I snuck some stuff under my desk actually. So it, I mean, it's been this box been ran through. But we got some uh, some pecan swirls, some uh, some junior coconut cakes. These honey buns, honey buns are fire, absolute gas. Ding dong looking things. There was like four bags of donuts, the chocolate and the powder glazed. Yeah, see, there's a bag of chocolate that maybe some of these, uh, some of those bad boys. I mean, whole box full of just fiery goodness. So shout out to Ashley for for coming through and uh, bringing really bringing me the bread. Something y'all may not know about Ashley is uh, Ashley actually drives a bread truck for a living. He delivers bread and baked goods like that for a living. So it was it was the coolest thing when we got an email and I read it and a, uh, I'm gonna try and pull up the clip and um, put that clip in this video somewhere so you guys can see the original clip of me reading his first email where he says, I'm the bread man, I deliver bread for a living, you know, I, I, I chase the bread, he delivers it every day, it was, it was a cool thing. So, you know, we have that. His truck's outside getting lifted right now, should be done today before the guys leave, so I wanna run outside, take a look at it, check up on the truck. Um, it's getting some it's getting some some kg ones and i'm i'm excited I, don't, I haven't done a body style like this on the channel yet so i'm excited let's go take a look at it This shop would be nothing without the guys that work out back. When I left last night, this truck had barely been started on. And when I come in this morning, it's done. You know, the guys stayed late, Brandon, Leonard, the guys that work in the shop, Jordan, all the rest of the guys, the, this, this, this place would be nothing without these guys. You guys think that we just wake up one day and the trucks are done, you know. I, I you know, I make everything look cool and I make it look fast and everything, but these guys, these guys stay late sometimes for you guys that come out of town. Ashley's truck got done, you know, in what, three or four hours? So he dropped it off at three or four o'clock yesterday and I come in this morning and the whole lift kit's done. The wheels and tires are mounted up. I mean, these guys really put in the hours to get these trucks done for you guys. And, you know, I just wanted to take this time to, to showcase and make sure that you guys know that none of this would get done without these guys back here. And I'm. Um, uh, everything that I do is because of these guys. So my success is based off of what these guys are able to pull off in the timely manner that they're able to get it done. So shout out to the Southern Tire team up here for uh, always pulling through in the clutch and getting shit done. Quick update on the F350 as well. Had to get a part ordered from Fabtech. This truck's turning out really good. So this color, once the truck is clean, is supposed to match this. So I'm, I'm really excited to see this done. It's the Dirt Logic coilovers. I mean, these these things are massive. Especially that, that reservoir up top, I think it's huge. But it's gonna be four link in the front. I believe four link in the back. It'll be set right about eight or nine inches on the 26 by 16s and 38s. It's, it's coming together. Like I said, we're waiting on a piece from Fabtech. So I mean, this, this build's gonna take a little bit longer than an average build. Something like this will be in and out in a day. Something like this will be here for a couple of days. And I, I, I may or may not have shown you guys the 26s that are going on this. But he's got some 26 by 16. I believe they're either Ruthless Forged or Plan B, one of the two. I can never remember. I think it's Plan B because of the center caps. It's got the floating caps with some 38 inch Furies. I mean, those are gonna look really good on that over there. I'm, ooh, I'm excited for that to come together. Then I'll take my bread gang hat off. What are you doing back there? Hey, go dogs! <laughs> hey, come on now. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Dave's bread killer? Dave's killer bread. Look at Only time I'll take my bread gang off. Bread, get, bread gang hat off. It's the only time. Only time you're going to see me take that off. No more Bass Pro Shop. 
We're Dave's. We're supporting Dave's Killer Bread today. We finished up a, a truck. Where's that light at? Where's the light? At? There we go. We finished up a truck today. That uh, what one of a kind. One of a kind. I'm gonna try and put the the clip of the email, uh, the 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 video of, of me reading the email that we got originally, um, from Mr. Ashley, the bread man himself. It every single time that we build a truck. They're all special, everybody's different, different people, different parts of the world, different parts of the country, different trucks, different lifestyles, different everything. One thing that's cool about Ashley is he delivers bread for a living. He, and, and you know, you saw in the video, he, he brought us a bunch of samples and a bunch of stuff and uh, um, we're, we're super grateful. I was eating some of the donuts this morning even though I probably shouldn't. And um, I, this, this one was just, this one's cool, you know, we, True drove down from Chicago. You guys saw the last video of me putting the 26s on. We're, we're building relationships with people that's bigger and beyond the trucks. It's not just me building the truck for customer number 758 and letting it ride. You know what I mean? This is this is different to me. It, it's it's bigger than that. And I'm, I'm just grateful for the for the opportunity to be able to, to build some cool stuff and meet some even nicer people and some even more amazing people. And uh, I just wanted, wanted to be able to say, you know, thank you to the bread man himself as he's sitting sitting here watching me film this for letting me build such a beautiful truck. I don't even know where to start. At this point, you guys know everything's my favorite. This color's my favorite. This wheel's my favorite, blah, blah, blah. You know, the, all, the, all the normal jazz, right? Brush guard is different. I don't think I've done one with a brush guard. I really like the brush guard. I was telling them when I bought my truck originally back in 14, 15, that brush guards on this body style is, is really nice and I, I'm really a fan of it. Finish this one up. Dropped it off, seven inch McGoy's, 2500 lift kit with the billet accents. Beautiful as always, you can't go wrong. 24 by 14 KG1 Aristos. I'm definitely a fan of the eight lug Aristo over the six lug. I'm sorry, Jake, but I gotta throw that in there. We did go with the chrome spike lug nuts and the billet caps, all metal caps. Gotta love it. 37, 13, 50, 24 Venom RT Plus. The, uh, the alternative to the Ridge Grappler. These are available. Most of the Ridge Grapplers are not, and I don't think Ridge Grappler makes a, uh, I, they do make one for a 24, but they're really expensive, and the Venoms are a great alternative. Great look, not too noisy, good wet traction. Uh, I'm a big fan of this uh, this Venom RT. Upgraded upper control arms with the billet accents as well. Always, always beautiful. I love that these uh, McGoy's torsion drop kits come with that back here as well that's always that's always really cool to see there are some kits that don't come with a torsion drop i think all the mcgoys come with the torsion drop just for you guys that have 2500s you will get this nice little back plate there and then uh, finish it off something something slight but something that a lot of people overlook the bw hitch gotta love it um i wish i had a big hitch on the back but you know i got my you know fucking men back there you know maybe we'll trade off one day we'll see Beautiful truck, another day. I love this body style, I really do. It's one of my favorites. I say that about everything. I know you guys hate me for it, but it really is. If I ever get a Duramax, like a dually, this is what I want, 100%. This, but a dually, so I can haul stuff. You get a trailer, haul loads of bread around or something like that maybe, I don't know. Something cool. Dave's Killer Bread. Out here chasing the bread with the bread man, Southern Tire. Chasing dreams, building dreams, living the dream. I love it. Shout out to Ashley for coming through. Awesome dude. Y'all ready for some uh, 26 by 16s on their 350 though? I know I am. From Charlotte though? Uh, no, I'm from Sanford. I go there for school. Sanford, what is that, Indiana? No, Sanford's in uh, North Carolina too. My family's from Raleigh, you know, showing oh, love Raleigh? to the... Oh. Please tell me you're not a UNC fan. Nah, bro. Okay, good. That's, that's all that matters. Rick, Rick came through all the way from Charlotte. So we got Mississippi that was here today, Augusta here last night, Charlotte here today. Um, what else we got right now? I think that's it for the week. Andre from Chicago was here earlier this week. That's why I got 26s on my truck right now. I mean, we, we've been all over the country today. And uh, I just wanted to show some love to, to Rick for coming through for getting a McGoy's kit. What up, guys? You know, uh, always, always, always got to show love to the guys that come through and, and watch the channel. It'll be, it's, it's cool as hell for me, especially when people come through. Like Ashley was just here a little while ago picking his truck up and he got to see Jay Ford and Jay Ford's truck in person. Um, I, Jay, Jay Ford might have been here when you were here, but it's, it's cool for, it keeps me grounded when people can come and see the same stuff here that they see 
like on a TV. People watch the TV at home and watch this video. People are gonna be watching this at home on TV. You're gonna be on TV. Let's do it. He's a YouTuber too, so y'all y'all need to stop. I'm gonna I'm try and get with me. Remind me. DM me on Instagram. Whatever you gotta do. Keep hold me accountable. I'm terrible about putting stuff on the screen when I say it. So y'all show some love. I'm gonna put his uh put his YouTube on the on the channel here. Let's try and get him to 100 subscribers or something. Let's do it. I'm, show I'm some love. Y'all blow up his comments. Make make sure he's posting videos. Oh, yeah. Stay consistent. Let's get this bread. I got two videos for y'all. Hopefully, I'll, I'll post them. Post I'm trying the my best. I'm trying post my best. Post the videos. Captain Goggles, if you're watching this, post more videos. I got other people like fishing channels. My buddy's got a yeah. fishing channel. I'm always on his ass. When are you posting a video? When are you posting a video? Hey, I get to it. never satisfy builds on the website. Go show some love. Let's get this bread. Let's get this bread. <laughs> show some love to my guy. What are you doing over there? Huh? What are you doing? Eyebrows? What are you doing, eyebrows? Yeah, show some love. Come on now. I wish I had some bread gang hats. Once y'all once y'all make me rich and famous, I'll put some bread gang hats and I'll start giving them away. Y'all ain't uh Y'all ain't showing love like that yet though. The transfer paper is a nightmare. So just be careful with it. I've had people do it perfect though, so it is doable. Yeah, and then I got a bunch of these. Dude. I've only got one oh, left yeah. of those, and I'm, I'm gonna give it to you. Bruh. So I only got one left. Come on, let's Dude, see it. Let's get this bread. Let's see it. Come let's on. See it. Okay, let's put, put me on camera. Put me on camera. Come on. You're making me nervous here. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I like I like having having fun with people. What if, if you can't have fun? What the hell are you doing? You know, I uh, until I upgraded to this, I used the same camera. Yeah, I still got it in my backpack. Exclusively at NeverSatisfiedBills.com. All right, guys. So you gotta know this guy right here. What you doing, bro? I've always wanted to do this. I, I haven't even done this on my own channel yet. Homie. Oh, you haven't? Oh, yes. First time I've ever done that. Out here counting, counting the bread, spreading it open, spreading oh, yeah. it open. Look, is Brandon gonna get mad at me for? Alex was here. Alex was here. Let me hear. Let me hear this straight. No, don't. No, don't. No, I mean, he's got a cap back, huh? I mean, a little bit. Nothing crazy. I mean, I can't go past four thousand anyway. He won't let me. Don't, don't. It does sound good. It really does. Shit, I ain't even bro. Why, dude, keep getting your bald head? Dang. It's 4K? <laughs> <laughs> hey. Sheeeeee. Right here, look, right here. Well, we can adjust it on the truck. Your center, your center tread right here. A little sneak peek. Hey, you should set it on the ground. Yeah, yeah. Big yeah. squatty boy. Yeah. Big squatty boy, huh? Yeah, but we can move it on the truck. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell If y'all saw my last video, y'all 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 messing with the twenty sixes, y'all messing with the twenty. I I like it. I'm right there. This this angle right here. Stupid, absolutely stupid. But the main reason we're here, twenty twenty F three fifty. It ends up being I think right at nine inches. Fabtech Dirt Logic coilover, color matched lift kit. 26 by 14, I, should, I need to ask the owner because I'm gonna look stupid in this video because I really don't know. I think these are plan B wheels. I'm 99% sure. Then we got a set of 38, 1550, 26, Fury MTs. Huge shout out to Fury, love Fury. This truck is just, it's, it's crazy. 
I love the color match. So this color, from what the customer told me, this color is the same exact color as the truck when the truck is clean, in his words. I mean, that, that four link kit, the front four link, I love it. I love all the red. You guys know I'm a red guy. I love all the red. I'm, the simplicity of this lift kit blows my mind. I mean, you, all, all you got's a big coil over and a couple of drop down four link bars. It, it makes no sense. But apparently, from what I'm told, this is one of the hardest lift kits to do. So it really makes no sense why this this lift kit is so difficult. But then again, I don't actually install the trucks, so it's it's nowhere for me to say how difficult it is. But it looks like he's got some color matched on the front. The bumpers are color matched. Grills color matched. Limited. I don't know if a limited is nicer than a platinum or what. This truck's got a good stance to it. It ends up being about eight in the back, nine in the front, I'm pretty sure. It's really nice. I was super excited to see this one. I haven't done a big one like this, especially on 26 by 16. You guys, you guys know I'm all about the big wheels. I'm all about the big wheels. I'm all about the wide wheels. And it's got the floating caps, baby. The floating caps. I love that. Let me know what you guys think. I'm trying to do some more forwards for you guys. We do have an any level lift truck that's getting built in January or February. And uh, I think within the next week or so, we're gonna be putting train horns and rock lights on that truck. And I think we're doing a set of rock lights on this truck today as well. So stay tuned, more stuff to come with this truck. And then uh, more, information, more information coming about the any level lift build in January and February as well. Like I said, we're doing a train horn kit on that truck soon and a, a 30 piece infinite off-road rock light kit. And then I think we're doing some wheel lights too. We're trying to knock out a bunch of stuff on that build before the actual lift kit comes and we install the lift kit. But a uh, bunch of cool stuff on a Monday morning coming in. I'm super excited. We got F350 on 2616s. Got the old bow tie sitting pretty on the 2614s. It's a beautiful day. It isn't too often that we get to see him above his setup. The Black High Country, Chrome FTS, and the Gladiators. I'm kind of digging it though. It's got a nice look to it. Ooh. Love it. See, so y'all better help that man out. Well, 5,000 probably. Well, views then. 15,000 views? Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. 15,000 views. That's what I was thinking. Oh, okay, 15,000 yeah. views. 15,000 views that's in fair. three days. Three days. When you want me to post this? I'm gonna post this video Thanksgiving night. Happy nah. Thanksgiving, motherfuckers. He's, you're gonna give me some bullshit ass, like huge Wait. number. Knowing damn well I can't pull off some hey. numbers like that. What number you want me to say? Hey, when you, when you, when you, when you this is real, this is real. I'm not joking around. <laughs> How many, how many likes do I do I gotta get in this video? This is gonna be at the beginning of the video, right? Mm -hmm. It's gonna be a full 30 minute video and this clip right here is gonna be at the beginning. How many likes for you to let me ride around on your forces for a Who week? Who have you become? Who have I become? You're just hoarding yourself out for- What are you talking you about? Get 15,000 likes in three days. 15, oh, okay, like that's really- That bounces around sleeping on I'm couches, giving you three but it's days. not couches. 15,000 likes? Three in days? three days. I ain't even gonna get 15,000 views in three that's days. 5,000 likes a day. Hey, excuse me, sir. It's $10,000 set of wheels. Hey, Thank yeah. you. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. And you're just bouncing around like lily pads, just <laughs> out surfing on 26 by 14s. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even have tires in your truck. What happens when you're in between couches? <laughs> Snowflakes. You're on 16s? <laughs> stocks. 16 inch stocks? See, so y'all better help that man out. I don't think that's possible. Huh? No, it's not. Well, 5,000 probably. Well, views then. 15,000 views? Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. 15,000 views. That's what I was thinking. Oh, okay, 15,000 views. views. Yeah. 15,000 views That's in bad. three days. Three days. When you want me to post this? I'm going to post this video Thanksgiving night. Happy ah. Thanksgiving, motherfuckers. Happy yeah. Thanksgiving. Right. I just bleep myself out to cuss again. You just call your subscribers. Motherfuckers. <laughs> you shouldn't do that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. 15,000 views in three days. 15,000. Look, it's Thanksgiving. Y'all should love. The gestures. I want some forces for a week. Better you, you take the whole fucking truck. Forces. I don't want the whole truck. I just want to put them on my truck. That's All right, bet. I'll take the whole truck. Jake, Jake can have the truck. He can put the 26 16s on the. I was going to put the 16s on my the tires truck. tires are too slick. I'm going to catch hell. We're not putting 16s. 15,000 views. It's too wide. It's too big. 16? No, it's not. 
You can put 16 wides on that. We had to raise it up some, though. No. Uh -huh. I'm 30, on, 35. Just like that. No yeah, good. but your Ray's higher than mine. Your truck's higher No, it's than mine. the same. The 16 wides don't hit it. Your, your new body style is taller. 15,000 views. Three days. So by Saturday at midnight. Nope. No, by... 309, three days from now. Not three days, so I don't post right now. Hey, I'm gonna post this Those Thanksgiving are the night. Three days from you time you post that video today. Fifteen thousand views, and we're putting the forces on the truck. I believe in you guys. Now I believe in it. I believe in the dream. I believe that this can happen. We're gonna put the forces on the bow tie. Stop playing around. Fifteen thousand views. Shout out to Jay Ford, though. One of the one of the nicest trucks Southern Tires ever put out. And then you got the the boss man, Lou. Different style, also one of the nicest that Southern Tires ever built. This unbelievably beautiful, full FTS kit, upper control arms. You got the front cross member with the uh, the chrome accents behind it, and the rear traction bars, the Archons, the Gladiators, the bumpers, the whole nine yards. You got J Ford, that beautiful blue. Same thing, color matched bumpers with all the chrome, full Magoy's kit, upper control arm, cross members, the rear traction bars, all the chrome. Stupid clean. Absolutely. Which which one would you drive though? On a real note, which one would you drive? The silver or the blue? That's tough. You know, you know I'm gonna be partial to the to the silver. Almost said blue. To the silver, because I drive silver, but that blue? That's crazy. Y'all run up the views. Y'all run up the views for me so I can uh, put the forces on my truck. Tahoe. Them. It's a beautiful day. I'll see you guys next time. Let's get this bread. Thank you.